Good morning, Julio. My name is Bree from Northland Marketing. How are you doing today? I spoke with you yesterday, and as promised, here is your analysis. I wanted to get on here real quick to go through your site in this video and do a website audit, show you personally what is holding your website back from being in the top three on Google. I'm going to jump in and start going through what we see and where we think you can get the most value. I'm going to mainly be going over three things you can do today to really bring value to your company and start outranking your competitors online. The very first thing I want to go over is your website and what we call content. When someone searches for a roofing company in Maryland, Google crawls the websites on the internet, searching and ranking the results. Google is looking for keywords, it's looking for what the site should be found for. Now when I go through your website, I see you have some great photos and a pretty good layout, but not enough content. One thing I can tell you about Google is Google loves content. They like to see a minimum of 1,500 words on your homepage, and you guys only have about 130. Adding another 1,300 words of content with the keywords you're trying to target is going to really make a difference in you being found on Google. Not only does Google come in and look at the content on your site, they're looking for the keywords and search terms. They can't tell what search terms they should be ranking you for if they can't find them on your website. Having those keywords on your page listed three to five times really ensures that Google is going to find you. I'm going to the search results. For Roofing Heightsville, Maryland, we can see that these guys are running Google Ads. Okay. And these are the top three that I listed. Now this is called the map pack. And the top three listed here are the ones that receive a lot of the work because they're super easy to find. They're listed right away. We list below here, these are called the organic. And the same applies for these. You want to be listed in at least the top three so you can drive a lot of traffic to your site. Now the first one is Yelp. The second one is Angie's List. The third one is Home Advisor, okay? But here, the fourth one, we have a real company. Let's take a look at their website. You can see they have an OK site with some content, but not a whole lot. So let's take a look at why they're first. This is a paid program called Arifs that I use to research websites. I went ahead and put their website into here so we can see what we're up against. The second thing I'm going to want to go over is UR and DR ratings. A DR rating is a trust rating, meaning how much Google trusts your website. A UR rating shows how powerful your website is in the eyes of Google. These are generally raised by backlinks. We can see they have 281 overall backlinks. And these are the powerful backlinks. They have 29 powerful backlinks. Okay. Now, a backlink refers to a link that points back to your website. In Google's eyes, it's almost like a popularity contest. For example, if a blog website wrote an article about roofing companies and listed your website URL as a company they recommended, they'd be giving you one backlink, okay? I want to call attention to their organic keywords. These are the keywords that are listed in their content. Now, keywords are important because this is how Google is going to find you, and this is a good example here, right? We can see that they're listed for a lot of irrelevant keywords. And even though they are listed pretty high for some of these, it's not really helping them get found on Google. Say, for example, flat roof pitch. There's about 100 people searching for that every single month. They're down in 40th place, which is the fourth page of Google, not helping them. And someone could be searching this in California. You want locations attached to these things for it to be relevant to where you are. The first location I found is Gutter Repair, Washington, DC. There's only about 20 people searching for that, but they're down in the sixth page anyway, so they're not gonna have anyone find them. Here we go, Roofing, Maryland. There's about 60 people searching for that, but they're again, they're down on the sixth page. Roofers, DC, another 20 people searching for that. Gutters, Maryland, 100 people searching for that, okay pretty good volume for the state of Maryland and some of the bigger towns inside Maryland as well. Depending on where you want to serve, we can get you ranking for those areas. If we look at your website's data, we can see that your UR and DR ratings are so low that nothing shows up. 
You have no bound links at all, and you only have four organic keywords. Now, when I take a look at those, they're nothing useful, right? It's your name and then care roofing. And for your name, it shows you're on the third page of Google and the fourth page of Google, right? This is because you don't have any ratings whatsoever, and Google doesn't see your website as a trustworthy website. But in this video, we went over how to get yourself onto that front page. One, through content and keywords and how your homepage is going to need at least 1,500 words. Two, your UR and DR ratings and how those would need to be raised by backlinks. And three, your backlinks, what your competition has for them and how to beat them out by showing Google you have more authority. And if you implemented these strategies today, you could be on the front page of Google. I wanted to go ahead and shoot this video for you guys. If you've liked what you've seen here today, you can email me back or give me a phone call. And we can continue to look further into what you'd need to get your website ranking to the top. I hope this was helpful for you, and I look forward to your feedback. Have a great day.